Spanish Ford High School football player is out of the hospital tonight after being shot in Gulf Shores. It happened last night during an argument on the public boardwalk near the beach. As Local 15's Christian Jennings reports, no arrests have been made in the case. No arrests have been made in the case, but police say they're looking for a guy between the ages of 16 and 18, last seen wearing a white hoodie sweatshirt. With the shooter still out there, kids and parents who are just trying to enjoy the beach on spring break are left feeling uneasy. He's out of the hospital now, but Gulf Shores police say 18-year-old Tommy Cortez Jackson was shot in the forearm last night after an argument broke out between a large group of teenagers on the public beach boardwalk. Approximately five shots rang out. Harley Wiggins is in Gulf Shores for spring break and certainly didn't expect to hear that while taking a walk on the beach last night with a friend. We heard a couple of gun gunshots and there were police and fire trucks and ambulances just came like speeding to the hangout. It was very scary. We just like stopped in our footsteps and we called and we went to another condo and then our moms came and picked us up because she didn't want us to walk back. With Mobile and Baldwin County Public Schools on spring break this week, Gulf Shores is packed with teenagers and parents. The ones I talked to said they aren't letting their children out of their sight after hearing the news. It was really shocking to hear that it happened down here on, on our beaches. Um, I don't let my kids go out at night that late. As long as I'm with my family. I feel like I can take care of them. My daughter could have been out here as well, so it's a concern for me. Gulf Shores police say this was an isolated incident, but they do want people to know that they have extra patrols in the area because of spring break already, and that will continue through the night and throughout the week. Reporting in Gulf Shores, I'm Christian Jennings, Local 15 News.